turn to politics now in the race for the White House. A new poll from one of the most important states in the nominating contest showing Hillary Clinton losing ground, possibly shaking up the Democratic race. While on the Republican side, that same poll showing Donald Trump is getting more and more likable. ABC's Devin Dwyer with the numbers and what they mean. Tonight, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Trouble for Hillary Clinton in a state where she knows defeat. Barack Obama will win the caucuses here in Iowa. Eight years after failing to win Iowa, a new poll of Democrats shows Clinton slipping, losing a third of her support since May. Her lead, now its lowest ever, just seven points ahead of Senator Bernie Sanders. This is not anti-Hillary Clinton. This is pro-Bernie Sanders and pro a message that says enough is enough. Sanders is leading Clinton in New Hampshire. Energizing liberals, particularly younger voters. And he's not the only Clinton alternative stirring excitement. Hey, Vice President Joe Biden surprises a jamboree of Delaware Democrats Saturday, building speculation he may get in the race. The new Iowa poll shows a door could be open for Biden. 14% of Iowa Democrats want Biden as their nominee. 13% remain undecided. Very good magazine this week. Meanwhile, a stunning turnaround in Iowa for GOP frontrunner Donald Trump. Three months ago, 63% of Republicans viewed him unfavorably. Now, a complete flip. At the back of the pack, New Jersey Governor Chris Christie, who today clarified a comment suggesting immigrants be trapped with systems used by shipper FedEx. And I don't mean people are packages, so let's not be ridiculous. The candidates trailing Trump now fully focused on making the cut for that next debate. As for Clinton, her campaign tonight shrugging off that latest poll, saying they always expected this race to be close. Tom?